Imagine a world where innovations aren't just revolutionary. They are life-saving marvels, from ingenious devices that defy the ordinary to groundbreaking solutions that rewrite the rules of safety, embark on a journey through the realm of inventions that aren't just visionary. They're the guardian angels of tomorrow's survival. Based on weather information, about every day, there's a tornado happening in the United States. This made a big demand for tornado shelters, and Valley Storm Shelters is a major player. They are well known for making top quality tornado protection. They have shelters in their catalog that go both above the ground and underground. The above ground shelters are really strong and can handle winds up to 482 km per hour. They are made with walls using 6 mm thick steel plates. The doors of these shelters weigh about 140 kg and are considered some of the toughest ones you can get. If a building doesn't have emergency escape routes, emergency services can use these cushions. They are strong enough to handle jumps from a building's 8th floor, which is about 25 meters high. A team of two people can set up the SP-16 cushion. An interesting thing is that the blue circle in the middle helps to make people less scared about jumping, as psychologists have found. Did you know the US Geological Survey tells us there are about 500,000 earthquakes happening all over the world every year? That's a lot, isn't it? That's why many countries are working on making buildings that can stay strong during earthquakes. Engineers at Stanford University tried out a special building made to handle earthquakes. This building sits on 12 parts that can move and uses curved steel plates. They tested it against a really strong earthquake, like a magnitude 11 on the Rho R scale. And guess what? The building stayed strong through the whole test. They're doing similar tests for earthquake-resistant buildings in Japan and Peru. It's interesting how they're finding ways to keep buildings safe during earthquakes in different parts of the world, right? Join our incredible journey through amazing discoveries and tech wonders. Hit that like, share and subscribe button to stay tuned for more fascinating updates. Don't miss out on the excitement. Be part of our community of discovery and innovation. Let's continue our journey. Deep Robotics has brought out a cool tool for rescuers. Now, it's not just real dogs, but also robot dogs that can help find people who are hurt or lost. Let's talk about the X20. It's got artificial intelligence built in and does searches all by itself without adding any extra weight. On just one charge, the X20 runs for about 4 hours and can cover around 15 kilometers. Depending on what's going on, it can even carry extra stuff like gas analyzers. Plus, it's really good at going upstairs and handling slopes that are up to 30 degrees. Cool, right? In action movies, the heroes often escape by gripping onto ladders or ropes dangling from helicopters. Similarly, the hot seat system operates on a comparable principle but it's primarily designed for rescue missions. It's important to emphasize that the hot seat isn't suitable for transporting individuals with severe spinal injuries. However, for victims who can sit in a semi-upright position, the hot seat is incredibly valuable. It has the capability to support a weight of up to 227 kilograms, and its storage bag is spacious enough to hold a helmet. This system is available for purchase at a price of $720. Take a look at this new way to stay safe from falling rocks, landslides, and debris flow. It's used in many different places worldwide. For example, in Switzerland, you'll see it on really long poles that can reach up to 13.5 meters. Also, in Norway, workers have set up 1,400 meters of this protection. In all these cases, Geobargy solutions come into action. This company holds the world record for how much energy it can absorb with its rockfall barriers. They can handle up to 10,000 kilojoules. Plus, GOBRG deals with challenges underwater too. They have solutions to prevent coastal erosion and to protect infrastructure if needed.
The folks at FireApp Power think they've made the smallest fire extinguisher in the world. It's designed to be about the size of a bottle, fitting easily in your hand. But don't let the size fool you. It's more effective than many regular extinguishers. This mini extinguisher can put out fires from electrical boxes to garbage cans. The FirePower FP50 version can tackle fires in an area of 0.2 square meters. It works for around 12 seconds and weighs only 480 grams. Would you consider it a good buy at $15? The CH-15 is an extremely thin respirator hood that's changing the way we protect ourselves from chemical, biological, radiation, and nuclear threats. Pretty amazing, isn't it? But there's more to why the CH-15 is so special. It's made in a size that fits everyone, and you can put it on in less than 10 seconds. You can wear it even if you use glasses, and you don't need to replace any parts. People who wear it can trust that they'll have at least 15 minutes of protection for their breathing eyes and face. You can purchase this respirator for $287. Think about shaking a sugar bowl. When you do that, the big clumps of sugar rise to the top. Well, the BCA Float E2 Avalanche Control Backpacks work a bit like that. They have something called an air cushion built in to make sure that people wearing them end up either on the surface or very close to it if there's an avalanche. The smallest one, the BCA Float E225, weighs only 2.7 kilograms along with the cushion. It has some cool features similar to earlier models, like things for skis and snowboards, and even has a radio built in. You can buy this backpack for $1,200. This dome isn't just a fancy idea, it's a real thing tested in Alaska. Its design is inspired by traditional Inuit igloos and origami methods. Because of its special shape that looks like water droplets, it's strong enough to handle powerful winds. When tested, the temperature difference between the inside and outside of the dome reached 24 degrees Celsius. Even though it looks delicate, the frame held a weight of 70 kilograms. These domes can be set up near hiking paths, giving hikers a fast and safe shelter if they face any issues during their hike. U-Safe devices are making a big difference in saving lives. Think about this one placed on a beach in Portugal. It's like an upgraded lifesaver. This device can move at a speed of up to 15 kilometers per hour. It's dropped from a helicopter near someone in trouble and all that person has to do is hold onto the handles. The USAFE device will smoothly pull them to safety, like to the shore or to a rescue ship. It's made to work well in salty water, and with one full charge, it can travel a distance of six kilometers. Plus, the remote control is easy to use and simple. 